Hey, hey everybody and welcome back to our weekly check-in video. So today we are going to be checking in from the 8th until today being the 14th. I am a little behind on checking in today. I got a little busy last night. But we are going to get it done today. So we had this week no bills come out. Next week will be the next bill. Um, so no bills this week. We did have a few transactions. Um... So let's go ahead and mark those. So we have Walmart. I did end up spending some money at Walmart. I went, I bought, I was doing a free Thanksgiving dinner and we picked up a few things from there. So I spent 120 at Walmart and I have $50 sitting in my Ibotta, which I will be able to cash out now. So not too bad, but I haven't cashed it out yet. So we haven't added it into here, but Pretty much we got everything we needed for Thanksgiving dinner, which is fabulous. We already got our turkey and I just got to pick up rolls or make rolls closer to on Thanksgiving. So that is fun. So, and then we added our fives and ones into our savings challenge here. So now we have a hundred there left over. So let's write those down. All right. So first up, we have Walmart. For 120. And then we added savings of $9. And this was both on Friday. Being yesterday. savings all right so then next let's see we haven't had any gas because i'm still waiting on our new debit card for my account that got hacked so we haven't had any gas transactions yet but we may be going to get in cash out and having to get gas because we we're both pretty low i did pull out the two dollars from my savings here and put it into savings so personal spending so savings, and I did that yesterday as well when I sat down to look over the thing and seeing if I had any fives or ones. So I went ahead and pulled those out. All right. And then the last category that we carry is miscellaneous. Oh, nope, that's bank. Miscellaneous, and there's nothing in here. So that means we haven't spent anything. And this one is for going to the bank. We put any money that we may use from the account and put it in here and then put it back into the bank. So we have nothing for that. So we haven't done a lot of spending this week. We did the Walmart, which was for half of it was over Thanksgiving stuff. And then a few things to last us through the rest of the month that I realized that we were missing. You know, when you think you have all your things you need and you don't, yeah, that was me this week. So we're going to take our Kate budget, Kate budgets, no spend stickers and lay them down from the 1st until the 12th. I love not having any spending days. It is fabulous. And then today. All right. So we don't have too many transactions at all, which is not going to take us too long to check in for them. We only have groceries and spending groceries. It was 129 as total. One twenty nine, and that left us total remaining of a hundred. Forgot the one. All right. So our groceries. So we have one hundred dollars, and that is it for the rest of the month, which is perfectly fine because we pretty much got the bulk of what we needed for Thanksgiving to celebrate the holiday. So that gives us about fifty dollars a week. For the rest of the month gas we spent nothing and we still have remaining the 99 for spending we only did the two dollars from the savings there so that means we have 20 remaining let's pull it out make sure for spending so just the 20 
right here. All right, and then miscellaneous was nothing. Still should have $50 remaining. There's that 50. All right. And then for unbudgeted, we haven't had anything that has been unbudgeted, which is always, always, always a blessing. So that is our first week or our second week for November. So we had one, two, three, four, five, six, no spend days this week, which gives us a total of seven, eight, nine days for the month so far of no spends. We have two, a little over two weeks left to go of this month and we are looking fabulous. We have filled in our transaction lock here so we can see it on this side. As y'all can tell, groceries and spending have been where we have done the most transactions. And we also had one sinking fund this week get used and that was our medical fund. Do any of y'all have a spouse or significant other that goes to like the most expensive store to buy one thing that they could have got for less than $5? Yeah, that's my husband. But I showed him that he could have gotten three medicine, medicine things that he picked up for the price of the one he paid at a convenience store. And I was like, oh. but anyways, it's already done and over with. Can't go back. But it was $16 for that. And we haven't used any other ones. I still got to order school pictures. Hopefully, I'll remember to do that one day this week. So that way they're done and taken care of. Mm. And I don't believe we have used anything else. We haven't been able to add anything to it. So I'm trying to make sure we don't spend anything if we don't really need it. But that is our second week for November. Not much going on. We've been trying to save our money we might end up having to move into my sister's for a few months but we shall see um i will keep y'all updated on that um but other than that that is all we have for this video i hope y'all enjoyed watching our weekly check-in it's a very short video this week and i can't wait to catch you in my next video bye bye now